we like to do is we start off with a warm up, a physical warm up, you know, get ourselves all warm and everything. And then we get ourselves into mics and then we do, or we also do a vocal warm up. <laughs> I think everyone kind of has their own thing that they need to do. Like some, some actors have got like rituals that they just have to go through um, in order to get in the zone. I mean, the warm up kind of helps with that. We kind of all get into the same space and we just get the blood flowing physically and vocally. It's good to get us mentally prepared for the show, get us physically and vocally prepared because it is a two and a half hour marathon of performance. So I feel like if we mentally and physically enable ourselves to be at that level from the beginning, we can only climb onwards with that. So I feel like they're the most important parts of any sort of production, making sure that there's a thorough warm up and clearing up any discrepancies that you have. I think this production is, it's not a by the book production. It is special and different, you know, they're, they're, it, the structure of it has been tweaked a bit and there's been, there, there's music in it that has been written by our MD. So it's very much a production of the life that you won't see anywhere else just because it's so our show. I think it is a very special musical, mm -hmm. to be honest, and I don't think there's a lot of musicals out there that do that, that highlight things that happen in a red light district. I don't know what some people probably perceive prostitutes in a way, you know, in a bad way, but it's nice to see some situations that they actually go through. And I think yeah. this musical has got something to say and it sort of, like we've said, it highlights a lot of the stuff that's going on literally just behind um, this yes. theatre. It highlights something that in Frankfurt is quite prevalent. Yes.